Alright, hello guys. Today I'll be showing you what are still some good like builds in this game right now. I've been catching up from this game since the last week to now, and I only have lots of Demon God Armor and Demon God Armor. Now I also have his staff and his I mean his sword and his staff her staff and I could tell you what the main um classes you should get if like if you want to like know the best classes then you got yourself Gajan. Gajan is very good if you're going for frosted demon god armor. Um another one is Death Way, but you could also use this. The reason why I use this is because um there's lots of magic builds that I use with this guys and this gives a boost like 50% more mana so the first most insane like thing is the last wish you can't go along with this this thing is like the best like thing you should get and it comes in first as it's incredibly good I'll just uh, raise my, I don't know, magic like this much. So, hold up. Let's just raise my magic a bit higher. Well, I'm gonna equalize it. For example, you have like these stats. You have to at least make your stats like equal to your magic. And you see how much damage. Oh shoot, I forgot one thing. Okay, so your build should have at least a last push. A love your school, anything that's healing, and you should have <coughs> like a blood shed. If not, you can get like a loud jump school or any healing, or even selfies is fine. And so, I forget mana. Oh my god! And you should also have this much mana, at least uh one thousand a hundred. Now the reason why you don't put it at one thousand three hundred and seventy-five is that it doesn't actually hit five. It doesn't actually hit like five times because it says it uses twenty five, twenty percent. You twenty percent. You expect to use five times? No, it actually uses four times. So put it to at least one thousand hundred, and we can see this in action. This is one. D four. And then you could keep on going, just hitting the orbs. It'll keep on going. It'll be faster. This thing is like very good as it's in you can hit it instantaneously, so no cooldown. You can also stack with it, okay, that's good. Thing the thing is it's so low mana. It's super low mana. Only 20 percent. The next um thing is gonna be the celestial collider. Okay, so all your stats will have to be um at least like one thousand and above. It can't be exactly one thousand, so it has to be like one thousand and one or above. <coughs> and why? Why is that? Well, because if you try to use it with the um only one thousand mana, you can also it doesn't work. It doesn't work. So if you put it just like a little bit more, it works. Just fine. And this is what it does. Just wait for it and it'll go. So HP. So you can literally just like do this again. And then you can just do it again. The big problem about this is that, um, there's a cooldown, a very big cooldown into a lot of magic damage. A lot of damage. So, yeah.
next one is gonna be this um, soul drain. Sorry about that. And basically, uh, the max damage is only like half of his HP, like only that much. That's the max damage until you're until like one of the developers, I guess, like buff up the level. Then it will do way more damage. But they're not. They're not gonna do that. So either way, this is it. It used to have like a very. It used to be so good with blood to mana school, where it just like obliterated anything. You could literally. It had no cooldown. You could literally just like spam the blood mana to mana school with the soul drain. It was so good. But now it's not anymore. But it's still good because of its damage. Its damage is actually still good, no matter its cooldown. Three seconds. No matter what. It's still good, and uh, if you have enough magic damage, if you don't really have em enough magic damage, then don't get the Celestial Fighter. If you have a lot of ma magic damage, uh, use the Celestial Fighter. This thing's insane, though. It li you could literally just like, hit them easily. Look at that, already 30,000. 30,000, man. The next one is going to be surprising to you. It's actually going to be surprising to you. And it's actually gonna be the Chaos Strike Scroll. The Chaos Strike Scroll is like, okay, I it's terrible, I know. But if you don't have anything else, and you just only have the Chaos Strike Scroll, it's gonna be good. Now, you need tons of magic damage in order for it to be very good. That's what it does. So, if I get enough mana. Um, it does that much damage. Although, if you get a lot of orbs, like, you just get bloodshed, for example, you can actually just spam it, and, um, yeah, you could pretty much shred the boss. It's, like, a very, very weak version of the, um, very, very weak version of the Chaos Strike. And, yeah, it does good damage. Actually, great damage. I mean, not really, but if you have a lot of magic damage, it'll do good damage. <laughs> 